Hello everyone, I welcome you to my broadcast today, and we are going to be broadcasting a few minutes here after these messages, so please stay with me. As we are playing right now, we are playing the, uh, what are you playing? Do you know what we're playing? I'll give you a hint. Life is what? Strange, right. Everything is strange in our lives. Now, I will tell you this. We are broadcasting live right now from Canada. What up? So, simple as this, is that uh, you are pretty much at a point where I can already time travel, but you haven't missed much. And please, if anybody's trying to send me spam messages, I will automatically remove you from this chat and broadcast. But still, please enjoy this broadcast, and uh, here we go. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. Victoria, excuse us. Never let one of photography's future avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making plans. Max, you're on fire. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Broadcast can be a little bit laggy. Just stick with it as best as you can. I hope I have enough to go to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Because Max wants everybody to see how he's asking. That girl is going to get sh Daniel. You know I don't have I hate that science class with those nerds. Okay, Max. Trace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with! Where did you get that? What are you doing? Come don't on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do! I need I'm a so hammer to break it open! People trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Holy shit, I can't let this happen! 
No. If I can reverse time again, I'll her. More trouble for this than tr would even miss your punk ass, would they? Keep that gun away. Keep that gun away from me, psycho! Oh shit! No! 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 Don't ever what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more this than drugs. No way! Don't ever again, freak! That did not happen. This cannot be. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not out. Hey, do you hear that? That means you should be outside. I had to use the. Girls always use that excuse. Just for what? Whatever you're up to, your face is covered in guilt. The alarm now. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield and please turn off that alarm since that's your... You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm... a worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. You're thinking about? You could all be up front with me, Max. Or have you... wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I just saw Nathan press... waving a gun around. In the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You yes, he was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happened from the town's most distinguished family. And Blackwell's most honored students. So for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion. Later, in my office, please decide with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course, Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. Does he hate me? Don't wander around here. Get on outside. You look a little stressed out. I just got sick in class. Um, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes down here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with the class. Please. 
No, he does not buy that I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. <laughs> yes, I could rewind and act on the truth. Well, let's see. I did tell you the truth. You look a little stressed out. I just saw. Uh, everything's all same shit all over again. All right, now I can go chill out. Would Nathan please come to the front office? Thank you. Oh. But. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair minded, Max. And we all say Rachel is found safe and sound, bless her soul. This petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land, pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going? In 1984. Miss Grant, I totally respect your passion and knowledge. Some security cameras make me feel a little safer. I'm not against security, Max. We should all be concerned when space becomes public. Your generation has been trained to think everything should be recorded. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Mr. Jefferson has searched for different styles. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous fallen soldier? Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. I need to go there and grab Warren's place. Clever. Uh, 
hello? Max, talking. Oh, sorry. I won't bother you. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd rather not, Daniel. Not that I don't want you to. Never mind. I guess you would be too ashamed. Now, I have to get back to my drawing. Do you mind, Max? Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to... Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple no slide or a tray, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. Come to thrash? I came to no slide, but I'd love to see somebody flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skateboard shit. Oh, we're going to destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You never really escaped Betty, though. I used to be, but I'm into my camera now. I can tell. We need more girls out here. Rachel Amber and her punk friend used to skate with us. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. She just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. Rollerblade and hang out with snobs like her. <laughs> <laughs> Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. Ran away. Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. You can fails. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason, and I have to find out why.
Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a war? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. I'm almost sure Warren has the same bag. It looks a bit nerdy, though. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? That looks like a drone. Model B400 EVO. Tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were more Here, give the drone around campus. Hey, Hayden. There she is, the retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell, especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Fair enough, but I'm still not going to party with him. Your loss, bro, is fucking hilarious when he's blazed. And he does always have the best shit. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't touch your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night. They can be so inclined to gossip. I don't think so. I'm not Miss Party. That's because you have a with us. Or even Victoria, who's pretty funny when she's baked. It seems weird about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh yeah, and she was hot. <laughs> What do you think to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Rachel was actually a vortex club? No. Rachel was like her own. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. 
Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. I'm more confused than before. It's such a mystery. Let's talk later, Hayden. That it is, Max. Now, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. They sure get a lot of mileage out of otter power. Otter power? I'm so not there. And this is where the otters perform their aquatic magic. Posters over posters? Somebody really... I'm sure this poster has stopped millions of bullies. I have a feeling I know who that person is uh, and who's given out those posters. Hey, hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I'm not sure yet. I mean, he's clearly a genius, but I don't agree with everything he says. He does get a bit pretentious, but he's passionate and just says what he thinks. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Not passionate. He doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. Logan, bring it, bro. Yeah. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Oh. Hi, Max. What are you reading? Of today or die forever. Oh. Don't even say anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now if you'll excuse me.
Football, Max. Big f Step away. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Nice. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there any... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. You'd think with all the rain here in Oregon, you wouldn't need to water the lawn. I guess Blackwell has to keep the lawn well manicured to look good on a catalog. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Dude. What a lame Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. No. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now. Why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. That's the first and last I expect to hear that. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt Daniel. I just want to get the hell out of the way. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look, oh, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Okay, let's see if this works. Awesome. What the hell? Are you kidding? 
kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? Oh, great. I can't even chill on the steps. Wet paint is not good for hair. No. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't with Max, bitches. Hmm. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. There'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. My heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself. -y. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know. I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. Au revoir. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Room 217? No way in hell am I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. They live. At least that's an alarm from this century. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Welcome to Black Hill. Blackwell isn't that big. It sure feels like a labyrinth. As if. 
Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Looks like on this TV, there's nothing left but ghosts. Hmm. How sad. I didn't write anything to say. Home sweet home, cocoon. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday and slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more.
it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Hmm. <laughs> Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I bonded forever. It makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Cartier-Bresson, Hamilton, yes. The Max Caulfield photo I've forgotten you, little Lisa. You are 30. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm through a window. Just looking. One day I'll organize my film club. One day I'll get an actual HD. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. You can't get out now, Dana. The truth are rotten there. Welcome to the real dreams of Blackwell. Oh, Victoria, give me a f break. You are ridiculous. If you don't let me out, I Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I talked to Dana in the room because we're cool. Your friend. Friends next with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why care? Why are you even asking me? Never talk. Just zone out with your camera. I'm talking to you now. Your last name. Juliet. Ju Juliet Olson. Truly sad. Thanks for your concern. Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in. Juliet, you be nice. I didn't <laughs> even think you knew. Uh, of course I do. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. If you don't let me out, I will scream. How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. You know that? 
But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my- Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Yes, I get it. Enter the club. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some prime lens. I hate you, Victoria. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Dior, Givenchy. You could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. Those boots are made for walking runways. <laughs> I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Okay, if I did wear expensive, I would wear this for sure. This better convince Juliet that Dana That is a tasty plot. Maybe I could sneak in and watch Final Fantasy then. I don't care what anybody says. That's one of the best films ever made. Speaking of selfies... Read this. Of course! And I hope so. I really think I'd mess up. No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you my laundry. You're like, what Zach has to say, Maria. You set me free. Thank you. 